My name's Jonathan Phillips. I'm Professor of Crusading History. The thing that fascinates me is trying to explain to a modern audience what drove the medieval world. What made people go on crusade to leave their homes, their families, their loved ones, to travel thousands of miles into the unknown? And conveying that idea, something that seems so alien to our modern world, to a modern audience, is what drives me on. My name's Ruth Cruikshank and I'm a senior lecturer in French and Comparative Literature and Culture in the School of Modern Languages, Literatures and Cultures, which is a fantastic place to work and to be a student. In my research, I look at representations of consumerism and globalisation in French literature, French film and French thought. And through this, I look at the way that we might be able to challenge some of the things that we take for granted in today's global marketplace and in our lives today. And this is what I do with students when we all work together looking at these issues and developing a more critical perspective on the world that we live in. I'm Courtney Norbury and I'm a reader in the psychology department and I'm also leading the SCALES project which is the largest study of risk for language delay at school entry in the UK. Our project involves over 188 schools in Surrey and we've screened 7,500 children in the last year. I also teach developmental disorders as a third year option and many of my students are involved in helping us with data collection for the SCALES project. My name is Jason Morgan and I'm a new professor in the Department of Earth Sciences. Earth Sciences is the application of physics, chemistry and biology to understand the history and evolution of our planet. And my work has recently been focusing on the study of such things as hydrothermal systems at mid-ocean ridges and the links between volcanism and climate change. I use the knowledge gained from my research to instill in introductory classes the realization that we have an incredibly incomplete knowledge of our planet and that the best in our science is still to come. My name is Ashok Jashpara. I'm a senior lecturer in our School of Management. I have written the best-selling book on knowledge management, which is used by business schools all over the world. I've also just recently finished three major research projects, and I really use the findings of those projects to inform all our students about what is the latest thinking in knowledge management around the world. We use case studies in all our classes from all over the world, and the, the classes are highly interactive where I get the students to question everything. Nothing is really off limits. I'm Dr Sarah Moore. I'm a senior lecturer in criminology and sociology. My first book, Ribbon Culture, won the British Sociological Association's book prize for best first book in sociology. I subsequently have gone on to study mass media depictions of sex crime and I use that research to form the basis of my third year teaching uh, for students taking crime in the media. I've just finished writing a textbook entitled Crime in the Media and that's really helped me make my research more accessible to students both here at Royal Holloway and across the country. My name is Phil Meeson, I'm a teacher and a researcher in the Department of Physics. Uh, some of the projects we have in going, going on in physics involve, for example, the search for the Higgs boson and now the, uh, the search for understanding what its properties might be. Uh, we have people developing uh, devices that use uh, quantum mechanics so that we can have new devices that measure things more sensitively or even maybe help develop uh, a quantum computer. Uh, and we have people working on the fundamental properties of materials trying to understand really what the basis of, a, let's say, a metal or a superfluid or a superconductor might be. One of the best things about uh, the way we run our teaching and research is that we can involve our students uh, through final year projects and other lecture courses actually in the projects that we're running. So you might find yourself really working on a, uh, a major research project in physics. My name is Laura Spence. I'm Professor of Business Ethics in the School of Management and Director of the Centre for Research into Sustainability. The centre supports a couple of programmes at the university, particularly the MSc in Sustainability and Management and our BSc in Management with Sustainability. Members of the Centre for Research in Sustainability are also involved in teaching subjects that they are particular research specialists on, whether that's around accounting for sustainability, ethical and environmental economics, environmental management or my own subject area which is responsible entrepreneurship where I study 
the social responsibility and ethical actions of entrepreneurs and small and medium-sized enterprises. I'm Dr Howard Falcon Lang in the Department of Earth Sciences and I research past climate change. Scientists like me spend a lot of time rooting around dusty old museum collections, but recently I got more than I bargained for. I stumbled across a collection of fossils made by Charles Darwin on his famous Voyage of the Beagle, which had been lost to science for 175 years. My name's Narendra Ranlani. I'm based in the psychology department here at Royal Holloway. My research program involves the study of brain mechanisms of higher cognition, so things like learning and decision making and how they're implemented in the brain and we use our uh, on-site MRI scanner to study those things. The courses that I run on our degree program are neuroscience based so students have an opportunity to learn about brain function going all the way from mechanisms of how neurons work right through to how large-scale systems in the brain work such as vision, hearing and movement. Uh, they also have a chance to talk about and learn about uh, disease mechanisms, so the ways in which Parkinson's disease and stroke happen in the brain and of course the way that they're treated. My name is Adrian Johnstone, I'm a Professor of Computing in the Computer Science Department. Uh, I run a £1.5 million government research project to investigate the mathematical underpinnings of programming languages and this is important because in computer science nearly everything in the end comes down to programming languages. My students learn how to develop small domain specific languages for areas of industry and managerial processes and the point about these is that the languages can be easily changed and this is important because in computing nothing stays the same for long. I'm Ennis Kegren from the Department of Geography. One of the real highlights of my teaching year is taking 50 second year undergraduate students to New York City for a week-long residential field trip. In many respects, New York is an urban laboratory for human geography, and students have the opportunity to put into practice in the field the theoretical ideas that they encounter in the lecture theatre through six staff-led projects. Hi, I'm Justin Champion and students who join us here at Royal Holloway in the History Department will explore the history of early modern ideas with me. We'll look at concepts of why we should obey kings, why we should be religious, why we should be tolerant. So my concern is to take students through a journey thinking about how those past ideas inflect and shape our modern world. My name is David Cohen, I'm a professor of computer science uh, and I do research on artificial intelligence. I've been involved in projects working with Vodafone and British Telecom and I'm currently working on improving the efficiency of workflow scheduling. My students at Royal Holloway learn robotics, they learn complex control systems and to program autonomous devices. Computer science has been the driver for many of the changes you see in the modern world. It's changed the way we do physics, biology, finance, economics, communication, and artificial intelligence is a key player in all of these changes. My name is Dr. Lizzie Coles Kemp, and I'm part of the Information Security Group here at Royal Holloway. We're one of the largest security groups of its type, and we not only make the technologies that sit inside your phones and your laptops, but we also look at how people use that security technology. So when our students come here to take our courses, they not only learn about security technologies, but also the social and organisational aspects. I'm Simon Blackburn, I'm a Professor of Pure Mathematics at Royal Holloway. And like all of my colleagues, I'm a real enthusiast for mathematics, both pure mathematics and its applications to real world problems. I was trained as an algebraist. I started off studying the mathematics of symmetry, which is a very pure area. But I've become interested also in the mathematics of communications, the sort of thing that you would see when computers communicate over the internet, and cryptography, making and breaking secret codes. And if you study mathematics at Royal Holloway, you'll have the opportunity to study all of these uh, aspects, both pure and applied. My name is Klaus Dodds. I'm Professor of Geopolitics at the Department of Geography. My area of interest is geopolitics, which is concerned with territory, resources and strategic access. One of my current research projects looks at the Falklands and why Britain and Argentina continue to argue over ownership and resources. Mm -hmm.